Hey guys, welcome to the Knot of the Week. Today we're going to be tying the heaving line knot. All right guys, so the first step in tying the heaving line knot is to talk about some of the applications for it. And this is a great alternative to the monkey's fist. If you've seen the monkey's fist as we've demonstrated here as well, you'll know that that's a great knot for heaving over a, a tree branch or something to pull a bear bag out of the way or something like that, or to throw a line across a stream if you're trying to uh, facilitate somebody crossing like a shallow water crossing or something like that. So this is just an alternative to that it's not as heavy as a monkey's fist, so that's you know a caveat to the heaving line knot. But first off to tie this, what you're going to do is take around a two foot section of line, and it just really depends on the thickness of the line, the, the length that you're going to need. But you're gonna form a bite in the line, and you'll, just as a kind of a checkpoint, you could use kind of a two inch measurement for the bite itself. And you're going to take that working end, and you're going to wrap around the bite. So that first wrap in this, and into the second is actually what's going to lock off that line. So you can see that that line now gets trapped in your wrappings and you're going to continue to wrap up towards the edge of the bite there, or the tip of the bite, until you get around five wraps in there and then you're gonna put the working end through that bite. And then what you're going to do is come around to the standing part of the line down here and you're just going to pull this through until you get this. So it's almost like a hangman's noose, if you will, uh, in terms of construction, just a little bit. Obviously, we're not using it for that purpose. But once you get those wraps, you just want to kind of keep cleaning those up by turning that until you can really lock up the knot and make sure that it's solid. Because the more solid it can be, the, the, the easier it's going to be to fly as you throw it. So that is how to tie the heaving line knot. Hey guys, thanks for watching the Knot of the Week. Remember to tune in each Tuesday, same knot time, same knot channel for a new episode. And if you're liking what we're doing here on the Knot of the Week and our other YouTube video series, please consider joining our Crew Leader membership linked below and allow us to give you back something in return. Thanks for watching.